January was a great month that saw my net worth increase by $17,900. Let's dig into what happened over the past month to get to this point. All coming up next. Hey everyone, thanks so much for watching this video. If you're new to this channel, my monthly net worth updates are going to be my cornerstone content that I'm happy to share with you. In between these monthly net worth updates, you are going to see the different ways that I have learned to build my net worth, invest, budget, and make more money. If this is something that you would be interested in, I recommend subscribing to this channel. Okay, back to my net worth update. It always makes me nervous when I see a number this solid come through. For me, $17,900 in one month is a great increase. And if this was consistent every month, I would be a millionaire in no time. But if you know anything about tracking your net worth, there are a lot of ups and downs. And if you continue to watch my videos, I can guarantee that you will see a down month or two. This is just how it is though. And the more your net worth increases, the bigger those swings are gonna be. Let's briefly talk about my current net worth. I am filming this on February 1st, 2023. I calculate all my data on the first of the month. If you want to know exactly how I calculate this data, leave me a comment below. As of today, my net worth is $679,050. If you watch my one year net worth update that I released on January 1st of last month, you might remember that my net worth at that time was $661,150. So here we are one month later with an increase of $17,900. But how did I get there? For starters, I will say that there were some things that increased and there were some things that stayed exactly the same. First, let's talk about what stayed the same and why. First up, we have my current primary residence. Last month, the value was $650,000, and this month, it is exactly the same. I actually believe it is possible to get more, as an almost identical home just sold in my neighborhood for $680,000. However, as you will find, I like to keep things conservative, especially with investments that are less liquid, like real estate. The one thing that did change, however, was what I owe on my mortgage. Since every month I make my payments on time, I now owe $352,900, down $900 from last month, which of course adds $900 to my net worth. Next up at my asset list that stayed the same is the vacant piece of land that I purchased last year. The current value that I assigned to this vacant piece of land is $130,000. Again, I actually believe that I could get more for this land if I sold it right now, especially since I already have engineering and architectural plans drawn up. But sticking to my conservative thoughts on real estate, I'm leaving the value as is for now. I bought this piece of land in cash, meaning I don't carry a mortgage for it, so this won't add or subtract from my net worth this month. That's it for my assets that stayed the same. Now let's hop into my more liquid assets of stocks, crypto, and cash. If you are invested in the stock market this month, you probably know that we did see a little bit of a bump which of course was a solid contributor to the increase of my net worth. Last month at this time, my Robinhood account was worth $140,000. And as of right now, it is worth $151,000, which of course is the biggest contributor to the increase of my net worth this month. I want to note here that I am invested in a bunch of different companies, mostly from when I initially started this account during the 2020 pandemic crash. But since mid 2022, I am only investing new money into three low cost index funds. Please comment if you are interested in me doing a standalone video on those. Coming up next, we're finally starting to see a small trend upward in the crypto world. And I was delighted to see that my account as of today is up to $16,000, which is an increase of $3,500 since last month. Still a far cry from the $57,000 this account was worth at the end of 2021, but I am hoping that we could get back there one day. I stopped putting new money into crypto at the beginning of last year, but I am interested in hearing from you all about your recent investments involving crypto. Lastly, we have cash. Last month at this time, I had $82,450 in cash, and today I have $84,950 in cash, which is an increase increase of $2,500 since last month. Now you might be asking, why do I have so much cash just sitting in my bank account? As someone who heavily favors real estate as an investment vehicle, it is very important for me to be able to jump on a deal if I find one. So that is the main reason I hold that much cash. Hey, real quick, I just wanted to say thanks so much for watching up to this point in the video. If you like the idea of seeing monthly net worth updates and also the details surrounding what it takes to build your net worth and make more money, I recommend subscribing to this channel. Also, please like, share, and comment to add to the conversation. As you can see, January was a very good month for me. But as I mentioned at the beginning of this video, it's not always going to be like that. There will be some down months, and of course, there will be some amazing months. As a channel dedicated to being as transparent as possible with my finances, you will see the good and the bad if you stick around. Let's do a quick recap of the changes in the past month that brought me to a net worth increase of $17,900. First up, we had my primary residence, which Although it didn't change in value, I paid down $900 with the principal in the past month, leaving me with plus $900 towards my net worth. Next, we had the vacant land at $130,000, which didn't change in value at all. Since I purchased the land in cash, it goes down as no change. After that, we talked about my Robinhood account, which is currently valued at $151,000, which gives me plus $11,000 for the month. This is by far the biggest contributor to my net worth increase this month. Next, we had my crypto holdings, which as of today are at $16,000, up $3,500 since last month. Sure, that was a solid increase, but I'm still down so much in crypto over a long period of time, so I'm curious to see if this increase will continue. Lastly was cash. Today, I have $84,950 in my bank account, which is up $2,500 since last month. This is another good reminder to myself that I am on track and saving money each month. This is obviously extremely important if you are trying to build your net worth. If you can't save cash, 
you aren't going to be able to invest. I hope that you all are finding these videos helpful. Please let me know if there's something else that you would like me to include in these monthly net worth updates. I would love your feedback. That's it for now. Until next time, keep at it. Hey everyone, thanks so much for You are gonna see the diff As of today, my net worth is 600, especially with investment. As someone who, f <laughs> all right. Okay. That's a lazy animal.